And now I'm here at Glade Central High School in Belle Glade. Behind me, a mentoring session organized by the group Take Stock in Children. Let's tell you about this wonderful organization. They are the Sensational 60 at Glade Central High School. Ninth grade students who are benefiting from the Take Stock in Children program. This nonprofit organization helps students by providing them with mentors, college readiness coaches, and scholarships. The program helps students like Stephen Barrett, who has a dream to graduate high school and college. Make those goals happen. Well, not they're not goals to me, they're dreams. To make those dreams happen, I'm going to stay working hard and focus even more. Adriana Garcia wants to go to FAU to be a doctor or lawyer. I started focusing more and studying more harder. You know, it's really, it's really challenging, but if you keep on doing these things, it'll help you accomplish your goals. Jasmine Mann has dreams of going to the Yale Law School and being a Supreme Court Justice. I'm taking advantage of having a mentor, which means I'll have somebody there to help guide me and make sure I'm on the right path of getting good grades and staying out of trouble and making sure I'm doing everything right. And Angela Dawkins wants to be a lawyer. In her last marking period, she received all A's in one B thanks to her hard work and the help she receives from the Take Stock in Children program. I am very thankful because I may not have an opportunity to go to law school and this can help me along the way. And as growing up as a child, a lot of people told me I'll never be nothing and this and that, but I'm very determined. I know I'm gonna be something and this program is helping me to achieve that. These 60 kids came together for a group picture. They represent almost a quarter of the freshman class at Glade Central. In fact, administrators call the program here the Take Stock in Children's Glade Central School Climate Change because this group can change the climate and culture at this school. As the pictures were being taken, they want everyone to know they are college bound. And recently they were college bound. As part of the program, they visited the University of Central Florida, where they had a chance to see the opportunities available if they work hard and get into college. Next up in February, a trip to Florida State University in Tallahassee. To go on that bus trip, you need to have A's, B's, and C's and be meeting with your mentor. And Marilyn will let you know how you can sign up for that trip. So only those that are excellent grades, meeting with their mentor and complying with the program are gonna be allowed to go. A key component of the Take Stock in Children program is the weekly mentoring. Latiel Allen meets with his mentor once a week. My buddy with my mentor is like very good. We're very close and like I can share stuff with him like that I won't be like that I won't feel comfortable sharing with anyone else and like we meet on a weekly basis. Latiel wants to be a fish and wildlife officer. He says the mentoring sessions will help him achieve his goal of going to the University of Florida. It's a constant reminder of what I need to do, stay focused and just push harder in school and not like lack off and be with the wrong group of people to get me off track. And like it's also like I'm very thankful for like the Take Stock and Children program. George Suarez has been a mentor for the past four years. I can tell you that um, when I show up here at school, I, my student comes to me and he's got a big smile on his face. I know that I've done a good job. He's doing a great job with the students. He helps out on a weekly basis, and George says he gets a lot out of the program. Oh, self-fulfillment to see students uh, go through a program and, you know, uh, achieve uh, a goal that they want to achieve, um, get educated, and uh, hopefully come back um, to the community and, and do what I do and, and help. Nancy Stellway is the executive director of the Take Stock in Children Palm Beach County chapter. The group helps 545 students attending 32 different high school and middle schools here in Palm Beach County. She talks with Glade Central administrators, including Principal Angela Moore. Well, at Glade Central High School, our theme is building a brand. And when we talk about building a brand, we're talking about quality and everything that we do. Uh, the first indicator of building a brand is quality of academics. And so to have those 61 students be a part of Take Stock in Children and knowing that this is gonna give them an opportunity to go to college kind of connects with that first indicator, which is the quality of academics. And so continue, continuing to push them and to motivate them to do well 
in, in their classes so that they can have those opportunities after college. I think um, the group, when you had an opportunity to see the group, I think it shows that the students are motivated to do their best to be able to do that. Nancy Stellaway is the executive director of the Palm Beach County chapter. The organization is Take Stock in Children. Nancy, congratulations on all the success you've had over here at Glade Central High School. 77 kids here on campus involved in your organization. It's pretty exciting that we were able to add um, 60 new freshmen to the existing Glade Central class that we have here um, and to really create a change in this class and a change in the culture so that all these kids as freshmen know they're going to college. What kind of difference are you making in the lives of these young people and you're getting so much help from the community but in the end it just seems like these kids are so much filled with gratitude but what kind of change are you seeing in some of these kids? We're seeing um, low-income students that really didn't have hope for a future that now know that someone really cares about them and someone is on their side and pushing them for a better life. Um, and it even goes as far as some of the families. We're impacting some of the families where we'll get parents that'll go back to college um, to improve their life. I know you were listening in to some of the interviews. These kids are filled with so much thanks. They, they have so many dreams. What's that make you feel like at the end of the day you really are making a difference? A, a proud mom. Um, <laughs> I often say I'm a mom of, of over 500 students, but it's really rewarding to know that the, the kids appreciate it and the kids want it. Part of the success of the program is the fact that you've been getting so many volunteer mentors. If someone wanted to help out kids and, and wanted to be a part of your great organization, how could they do it? Um, to become a mentor for our organization, our mentors go into the school about 30 minutes, one day a week during the students' lunchtime and meet with them on school grounds. And they can go to our website at takestockpalmbeach.org and um, click the mentor tab and become a mentor that way. All right, and you can really get a sense of how appreciative these kids are for this wonderful program. Nancy, thank you so much and, and congratulations on all your good work. Thank you.